Hello YouTube, this is Rockstar Lennox and welcome to my very brand new YouTube channel. The first game I'm about to walk through slash let's play is Bully Scholarship Edition for the Xbox 360. I played the original Bully for the PlayStation 2 back in 2006 and I really really loved the game so I thought I'd give this one a try. The difference between the original Bully and Bully Scholarship Edition is improved graphics, 8 new missions, 4 new classes and 4 new characters. So let's get rocking. Jimmy, please say something. James? What? Who are you? Mom, I thought you told me never to talk to strangers. Like I said before, Jimmy, please be nice to your new stepfather. Okay, rich guy. I love it that you're twice as old as my grandfather and you're fat and bald. Uh. That's enough! I've had it with you, you little brat! You've upset your mother. I've got half a mind to beat you. Half a mind is right. Suddenly he realizes. I can't believe you, you little monster. We'll deal with you when we get back from our honeymoon next year. Here we are, boy. Bullworth Academy. Have fun, Jimmy. I'll think of you from our cruise ship. <laughs> Whatever. Mom, why'd you marry that phony? What is wrong with you? Oh, I can't believe this. You must be the huh? Hopkins boy. Where'd you come from? We've been expecting you. Welcome to Bullworth Academy. Oh, I'm sure you'll be very happy here. Very happy indeed. Anyway, I can't spend my life waiting around for naughty little boys. I've got a man to make happy. The headmaster is expecting you, Hopkins, in his study. Okay. His study is over there, boy, in the main building. Don't keep Dr. Crabblesnitch waiting. He's a brilliant man. Brilliant. Okay, so welcome back. It's the first day of school. Let's go. That's you fine. know I don't how many styles I know? Man, are you serious? I've been here for only two seconds and these dudes already want to fight? Okay, let's go over here where there's no school security. And bam. Three on one, this ain't fair, but I'll take all three of you. And bam, knockout. Okay, let's go to the principal's office. Let's run there before some more bullies try to beat me up. Man, you can tell this school is really fucked up when you've been here for only two seconds and people are already trying to fight you. Hello there, ma'am. Yes. So, you must be Hopkins. Uh, uh-huh. What? Uh-huh. What? I meant yes, sir. Very good. Now, let me see. You've done a lot of naughty things, haven't you? 
Vandalism, graffiti, bad language, violent conduct, disrespecting staff. Oh, I'm scared of you, Hopkins. Come on, give me a break. Yes, I've never met a boy like you. Never in all my life. Hopkins, you're quite the nastiest little boy I have ever encountered. Tell me, why should I waste my time on you? I don't know. Because it's my calling. It's what I do. You excel at causing trouble, and I excel at fixing little boys like you at making you into respectable members of our community here at the Academy. I've got a good feeling about you, boy. A feeling you and I are going to be great friends. You keep that nose clean, boy, or I shall clean it myself. Miss Danvers, are you back yet? Yes, Headmaster. And I got your tea. You are good to me, Miss Danvers. No more than you deserve, Headmaster. Take our new friend Hopkins here and show him around the school and get him properly attired. Certainly, Headmaster. Come along, boy. I haven't got all day. And boy, remember, you will have a clean nose. So keep it clean, or we'll clean it for you. So here I am at probably the worst school in the country whose alumni are nothing but arms dealers, serial killers, and corporate lawyers. Real scum. And that old creep thinks he can tame me? We shall see, my friend. I only give people what they have coming to them. Where's your uniform, young Hopkins? Run along now, child. All right, I'll go get my school uniform. Okay, so let's go to the boys' dorm to get this uniform. <laughs> it's about to go down. Guess what time it is? Yep, time for a beat down. Get the new kid, beat him down. Okay, so I guess those bullies I beat up in the beginning got their homeboys to get revenge on me. Okay, let's humiliate them. young man go change immediately ah oh, come on hey you're the new kid yeah what's it to you friendly aren't you give me a break loser hey relax friend you're all pent up go easy or they put you on medication they did to me. Boy, nearly sent me insane. That's fascinating. Now if you'll excuse me. I said me. relax, friend. Get off, man. Listen to me, tough guy. You just arrived at the toughest school in the country, and I'm offering to be your friend. Trust me, in a place like this, you're gonna need friends. So it's up to you. You gonna play nice or what? Yeah, sure. Good. So how about I show you around? <laughs> We don't have a bar in the door. Just a Miss bitch. Okay, these bullies are getting really irritating. They keep following me everywhere I go. Get off. Then you see what happened to your friend outside? Let's talk some trash. Okay, let's get a soda real quick. You should probably change into your uniform if you don't want to get in trouble. And let's go get that uniform. Man, wearing a school uniform has got to suck. Hey, how you doing? You must be the new kid. I'm Pete. Pete Kowalski. Jimmy Hopkins, and don't ask how I'm doing. I've been here five minutes, and already people want me dead. 
Even my parents didn't hate me this quickly. Well, welcome to Bullworth. It's a dump. Great. I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent. Yeah, I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent because I'm really bad. Give up the tough guy act, pal. Hey, man, what's your problem? Well, ADD primarily, but also life. My parents, this school, Western civilization. But really, honestly, enough about me. Oh, I see you've met the dorm's mascot. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Femboy, the girliest boy in school. Petey, haven't you got some imaginary friends to go annoy? Why don't you leave me alone, Gary? <laughs> Look at you. Leave me alone, Gary. I'm really self-important now that I finally hit puberty. What's your problem? I'm just being nice to the new kid as he passes through Bullworth on his inevitable journey to prison. Look, I gotta unpack. Would you guys mind getting out of here? <laughs> oh, now look what you've done, Pete. Jimmy can't stand you already. Okay, let me save real quick. Okay, and let's go do the first mission. Okay, so the first mission is at the school, I believe. Let's run there before some more bullies try to jump me. Okay, so I guess we gotta follow Gary. That's Russell's locker. You know, the big ape who almost put you in the hospital. Vocal cord out. Oh man, I, we gotta apologize. I don't wanna apologize to this big fucking gorilla. Don't pick on me. Your money, all of it. Oh, I don't wanna pay this dude my money. Please, you don't wanna do this. Scar's face. Before Russell. Screw you, Russell. Next time you get more doofus. Come on, let's break into it and steal something. That'll teach him. Okay, let's steal something for him taking my money. Don't let the okay, right. Break any rules. Left. Ah, right, left, and this one open. Bam, finally got me a cap sick. Man, I hate how we can't move during these little tutorials you do know you're not supposed to be doing that okay so we gotta hide in this trash right here I don't like you neither okay so I guess it's safe to get out now Man, I don't know why we're friends with this fucking idiot. <laughs> ah, I hate Gary already. Oh man, there's that weird chick Eunice. Let's have some fun with her. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Go, see what she wants. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Hey you. Man, I don't want to get her chocolate. She can get her own chocolate. Okay, I guess we gotta get this fat bitch's chocolate. There he is. Show what you're made of, Jimmy. Eating someone else's chocolate? That's messed up. Does that make you feel big and strong? Damn right. Okay, let's go back and give this fat bitch a chocolate. Thanks. 
Um, wanna make out? No. Mm -hmm. Ah, get off of me. Mm -hmm. Ah. Sheesh. I'll remember this forever. You actually Look who it is. kissed her. Ah, that was nasty. Please. Ah. Ah, now she's following me. Get away from me. Run. <laughs> time at the zoo okay here's the deal over there we got the nerds of course they're complete social outcasts they look pretty harmless they're actually sneaky bastards their turf is the library and those are the preps they're all money and condescending attitudes yeah massively inbred and completely brainless very observant jimmy boy now over there are the greasers they think they're tough or at least try to look tough wouldn't advise messing with them, at least not yet. They hang by the auto shop. And last but not least, the jocks. These guys rule the school. Definitely avoid them. Whatever, I'm not afraid of some dumb roid monkeys. You'll learn. Come on, let's go. You're here to learn, not to goof off. Get to class. Man, I hate how we can't move during these little on-screen tutorials. I mean, I could read while I'm walking. Come on. Okay, so let's go to the first class. Chemistry. What are you doing in here? Oh, right. Class. Dumbass. Take care to follow my instructions precisely, as we will be working with volatile chemicals today. Okay. Hmm, very good. Carry on. Keep up the good work. Almost done. Fascinating, isn't it? Excellent work today, Mr. Hunter. Like a boss. I'm the best. Firecrackers, sick. Job well done. Alright, I'm gonna end this part here. Like and favorite if you enjoy, and subscribe to join the band and become a rock star. <laughs>